I doing all the way out there when it's time to capture the flag? There's one enemy still out there. Well, my thought process was I'm just going to I'm gonna camp to where I can see where the flag is at. We got three people that only got one more left. They're going to be desperate to at least capture the flag. So that's just my train of thought here. Um, and obviously it worked out because you see what happened to the one guy there. You know, he got clipped. And I'm pretty sure that second person, he was down on health. He would probably would have gotten taken out as well. So I'm kind of that reinforced backup. I was quick thinking that I was able to uh, switch to my other gun, but that's something that shouldn't necessarily happen often. But it does happen. Like, there is no quick reload. There is no automatic reload after you run out of bullets. You gotta manually uh, reload your gun. So that was just one of those situations where uh, the guy had me dead to rights, but I don't think he was looking in my direction. I mean, I had other teammates out there on the perimeter running around, so it probably took... The person's eyes off of me but you know I got pretty lucky there um, you know quick reaction I've been in that situation a couple times where it didn't work out that way obviously This is just a sniper shootout essentially. Um, obviously he's seen me and uh, I know where he was at because I was crawling but thinking that I would peek out and just get that quick shot off but you seen that he shot me first and I just kept my composure and you know obviously it's a video game so there's, there's no real flinching going on. I mean there is a little bit of flinching. But uh, from the characters, I would say, but not from the person playing the game. So, and this was just a quick shootout, you know, and I got got lucky again. I just want to say, I'm not just sitting up there, just sitting. I'm actually looking around, surveying, surveying the area. Um, it's just the way how the camera is. You're able to look around without peeking your head out. And that's the advantage of uh, shooting from third person. Um, or I should say viewing from third person as you're, you're able to scope out the area. And um, once I noticed my there was a teammate that was just running in that direction, you know, I stood up, you know, I seen the guy, and try to get off a shot as fast as I can. And that's why I didn't get a clear headshot, because I was trying to hit that guy before he got my guy. Because um, that's just how I am. I'm, I'm not going to wait till my guy goes down to get a clean shot. You know, I shot at him, it threw off his focus, and he wasn't able to hit my guy. Then um, I was lucky enough to get another shot for a headshot. So, uh... All in all, it was a is a decent play, a teamwork essentially. Um, yeah.
These are one of my high IQ plays, I like to call them, but three people on their team. I'm the last one standing on my side, and, um, you know, the time is running out, time to capture the flag. So, what I normally do is I will stand by that little rock, I'll jump on top, and I have a peek right into that small window. I can see the flag when it pops up, and... This happens all the time. I'm, I always catch someone there trying to capture a flag. And I think that guy did a bad job because he heard me shooting. And he seen, you know, uh, one of his teammates uh, get killed. So you would think he would try to hold down the spot or come out and try to help his teammate. Because um, they have the, the numbers advantage. But he sat there and tried to capture the flag. I had a clear view on him. So, uh, the one guy running down the mountain, I don't know what his thought process was. And, I mean, obviously you got the one guy in the house. Only thing you have to do is keep a lookout and make sure there's no enemies coming into that house. And, um, and even so, even so if the enemy goes into that house, they still got to kill your teammate and they still got to capture the flag themselves. And while they're capturing the flag, um, they are, you know, uh, defenseless. So, just a bad play on their side and uh, a good play on my side.